what's up? So I did this video presentation recently, right? It had some cool replicant features and then it hit me. How cool would it be to present myself as a virtual avatar courtesy of replicant? That's exactly what I did. The whole point is to show you how easily you can create this kind of content for your own videos. In replicant, you can pretty much make like any kind of shape of character. And since it's a precise feature system, you can also kind of mix and match from skins to outfits. And as you can see, there's a lot of sliders to control and the size. You want to see the scalable bone system. You can go in and make any kind of shape, but characters need to be somewhere. They need a stage to perform, right? So Replicant includes tools and libraries of environments which we can use directly or even create our own. Let me show you. Hello. Welcome to the Arctic or what's left of it. Replicant contains lots of 3D environments to use in your scenes, which you can also navigate them just like in a third person game. We have a very kind of cool way of giving you 360, you know, photographic environments. You can basically generate whatever you want. Once it's generated, it's in your library and you can load it. You can save them all and it all can save into your project. This is so cool, isn't it? And then the last bit that's really good fun is the AI script writer. So what this does, it gives you some brainstorming ideas on, you know, in terms of stories and so on. And you can basically kind of, you know, let the AI write something and then you can go in and tweak it. So it's, it's a very kind of quick way of creating content. And especially once we can do after the script is generated, we can actually kind of extract it to the timeline. And that really kind of saves you a lot of time. So here you see the script being analyzed and generated. It makes all the, you know, the animations, the emotions, the lip sync, the camera cuts and the voices. And at any moment of time, you can go back and refine it and, and spend, you know, as much time as you want. Wow. I've spent some time playing with backgrounds, light and cameras. And, you know, it's been a lot of fun. You want to see what I came up with? Let me show you. Do you think it's possible for the Arctic to turn into a desert? I don't know, Bob. It seems unlikely, doesn't it? I mean, with all the climate change that's happening, anything is possible. That's true. But we have to be careful not to jump into conclusions without enough scientific evidence. Yeah, I know. But still, the thought of it is pretty scary. I understand why you feel that way. But let's focus on what we can do to help prevent any further damage to the environment. You're right. We can start by reducing our carbon footprint and raising awareness about the importance of protecting our planet. What's up? So I did this video presentation recently, right? It's, it had some cool replicant features and then it hit me. How, how cool would it be to present myself as a virtual avatar courtesy of replicant? That's exactly what I did. The whole point is to show you how easily you can create this kind of content for your own videos.